Let's take a look at the form for submitting a nomination to the North Dakota Cowboy Hall of Fame Hall of Honorees. We do have separate forms for each category of induction, so start by making sure you're looking at the right form. For the purposes of today's presentation, I'm going to use this ranching modern era form, but you can find all of the nomination forms on the North Dakota Cowboy Hall of Fame website at NorthDakotaCowboy.com. Just click on this Hall of Honorees button and it'll take you to links to all of the nomination forms. You'll also find a video there that will show you how to download those forms to your computer and the instructions are good for both a Mac or a PC or Windows based system. We've done what we can to simplify the form as much as possible so today we're just going to take a look at a few of the items that we hope will make this form even easier for you to complete. First and foremost, item number one. Nominations absolutely cannot be accepted without the support of a North Dakota Cowboy Hall of Fame trustee. And this would be a trustee who is currently active at the North Dakota Cowboy Hall of Fame. In addition to the contact information, it's imperative that we have their signature. Any submission that comes in without this signature will be sent back to the nominating party. If you need to be put in touch with a trustee, you can get in touch with us at the North Dakota Cowboy Hall of Fame and we'll get you the contact information for a trustee in your district who may be able to help. At the top of page two, you'll find the criteria for your category. This is a great opportunity to double check and make absolutely certain that you have selected the right category for your nominee. We do ask that you answer every question on the form. In cases where the information is not available or perhaps not applicable, if you would indicate that somehow, anything that would indicate that you have read that question and the information just wasn't available. On the next pages, you'll continue to build the story around your nominee. If you need to use additional pages, please feel free to do that. In naming notable relatives, influential supporters, and mentors, please be sure to include contact information so that we can get in touch with these people to learn more about the story of your nominee. In the cases of ranches and livestock, we would love to include a display of your brand. You can do that by sending a digital file, a photograph of the brand, or even simply just drawing it in this box. Our graphic designer is going to recreate these for uniformity, so any manner that you can think of to get that brand information to us is quite fine. If a brand is not available, please simply indicate that here on the line so that we know that you did see the question. In item number 15, we're asking that you list the resources that you use to compile the history on your nominee. Please include any contact information that's available in case we need to do some fact finding or verification. We hope that you'll spend a reasonable amount of time carefully crafting item number 16, your nominee's biography. Should your nominee be inducted into the North Dakota Cowboy Hall of Fame, this biography is the information that future generations will use to get to know your inductee. Please edit your biography down to 350 words and submit it in a digital format, either a Word document or a text editor file. If you need some professional assistance in writing your biography, get in touch with the North Dakota Cowboy Hall of Fame. They in turn will give you contact information for professional writers who may be of assistance. Please also follow instructions carefully for item number 17, the portrait. Keep in mind that this photograph, like the biography, will be on permanent display in the North Dakota Cowboy Hall of Fame Hall of Honorees for generations to enjoy. Do your best to select a good quality portrait that shows only the head and shoulders of your nominee. For a good example of a photo and biography, let's visit the page of 2018 North Dakota Cowboy Hall of Fame inductee Chad Berger. From the home page of our website, click on the Hall of Honorees. The directory of inductees comes up. You can scroll down, get that a little bigger on your screen if you like. And in the search bar, I'm just going to put Berger. There's Chad right here. Click on that. Here's his photograph and his carefully constructed biography. We understand that not all of our nominees will have access to a professional photograph such as this one. However, this still serves as a good example of the kind of composition that you should look for. 
As with the biography, please submit your photograph as a digital file. We're asking that your file be at least 5 by 7 inches at 300 ppi. This is a high resolution photograph. Please save the file in either the JPEG or TIFF format. If working with a professional printer, please give them these specs. In the next video in our series, Rick Thompson is going to take you through the assembly of your three ring binder, so I'm going to skip over that. And item number 20 is just a last look, a final checklist to make sure that you haven't missed anything before submitting your nomination to Becky Sheaf. Here's the address and here's the date. Don't miss it. Saturday, December 15th, 2018 is the last day to submit your nomination for consideration for the 2019 class of the North Dakota Cowboy Hall of Fame Hall of Honorees. Hope this video has been helpful. If you have any other questions, please don't hesitate to get in touch with us. You can call the Hall of Fame 701-623-2000 or you can get in touch with us by email at heritage at North Dakota Cowboy dot com.